Here's how to beat the monkey boss in Wolong Fallen Dynasty. To beat it, you need to get right up in its face, hold your guard, and aim to deflect its two or three combo slams. Once it's done them, you can hit back with two light attacks and a heavy spirit attack. I'll be using the Ring Pommel Saber, which is the starting weapon everyone has. Apart from that, the key here is to focus purely on holding guard while you press dodge once to deflect its attacks. The window to attack is always short with this boss, which is why you need to be right up in its face. So hold guard and just wait for it. And deflect. Okay, this red attack is the one you want the most as this is where you can do the most damage. You need to deflect it. Like all deflects, the correct timing is just before it hits you. In this case, you're watching for when it leans back and its two big feet comes up at you. The pause on screen now is the ideal time to press your deflect button. While it's down, do some lights and a martial art or spirit attack to break it. Keep hitting it for a short time after the red fatal blow icon is displayed, and then press spirit attack to do the critical attack. And that's the loop for the whole fight. Hold guard, deflect until its combo is out, then a couple of light and heavy attacks. When it jumps back, it is often that red attack we went over before. Again, always get in some light attacks first before you press your spirit attack to do that fatal blow. The key here, like any Wolong fight, is to master your deflex. There's no way around it with this boss either, so you just have to do it. But it's a lot easier to learn by getting right up in its face instead of trying to back off and deflect from afar. You just have to be patient and wait for the two or three combo slams to end before you dish out some of your own damage. If you don't wait, he can interrupt you and give you a smacking. I find it's helpful to think of deflect as just being a dodge at the very last minute. As long as you're always holding guard, even if you miss that dodge, you'll be okay. There's plenty of room in this fight to heal up to if you get hurt too badly. If you want to rapidly tap your guard button instead of holding it, you'll recover your spirit faster. Honestly, there's not much to this boss. You just have to be aggressive, up in its grill, be patient with waiting for its combos to play out, and then do your attacks. Anyway, thanks for watching, have fun, and I'll see you in the next video.